your people. Okay, so I thought I'd give you a, um, a by the way, I'm in the middle of Somerset over there. I don't know if you can see it, but that's Glastonbury Tour. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd give you a little tour of my van. Um, it's not finished yet. Like, still needs things done to it. It's probably about 85% finished, but so I wasn't going to do this until I uh, finished it. But since we're on this bullshit lockdown nonsense, I thought I'd uh, give you a little tour. Anyway, here we go. So, here we go. So, there is my little kitchen. As you can see, this thing, it's a pain in the ass. It's a pain in the ass, the water pump. It's definitely something I need to fix better, but it works. It works, but it spills out the bottom and they really need an electric one, but I haven't sorted that out. Gas, cool. Little grill. That is really cool. Well, yeah, under here, there's the water. There's the wastewater. There's the gas, my kettle. Okay, so up above here, I've got storage. Still need to insulate that, really, but does the job at the moment uh, and then here I've got toilet and shower needed very much needed uh, especially in the lockdown it's been a saviour so I can actually have a shower the, sh the shower I've got is like it's only like a it's a pump thing so Put that in the water, put that in that bucket, fill it with water, fill it with hot water, boil it from there. Gives me a good shower. I've got like a hole in there, so I let the plug go out, the water go out. The toilet is one of those ones you can just empty, so a saviour. So that's a saviour. That's been cool, you know. I had to have a toilet and a shower. God knows what van people are doing at the moment with no toilet and showers because... Like, you know, I go to the gym mostly for my showers. I very don't re often use this, but it's I've, I've been using it now because I've needed it. But all well, the gyms are shut. So it's like, I don't know what people are doing in vans without, if they haven't put a shower in. It's like some smelly van people out there. I know that. So yeah, that's been a savior. So I'll keep that little lock there. This is, uh, obviously, this, I bought this. See for sight radio, but it also works as my radio in here, and it's priceless. Six music is a savior, generally, and on the lockdown for sure. Peace up. Uh, here's my battery thing for the solar stuff that needs to be sorted. That's really not adequate enough. I've only got a hundred watt solar panel, which I'll show you. So, there's my hundred watt, and I need to get like more than 100 watts here enough. So that's like, yeah, that's saying that, that's my next thing, expenditure to do. So uh, yeah, like I've got a drawers, drawers down here. So as you can see, little drawers in there, some stuff in there. Got my, all that in there. And then I've got like a, a drawer of stuff, you know? You have to have a drawer of stuff, man. It's just, just loads of good stuff. That's actually organised, I mean, it gets messy. And then I got like a computer that I can obviously plug in when the solar's going. Um, joystick, always hanging with Buddha. Uh, clock, that's really cool. Waking up, knowing what time it is. I know what time it is. Uh, so yeah, it's like, uh, that's to remind me not to smoke. Uh, cladded, um, yeah, put some pictures up to uh, be homely, which is cool. Bob Marley, uprising, yeah. Uh, that's my hats uh, thing. So it's important to store your hat so they get squashed. Found it out early. Uh, yeah, like the bed, it's pretty tidy at the moment. That's the job. And as you can see at the back, I've uh, put carpet tiles on the back. I don't know if you can see that. I think you can. Carpet tiles on the back. Really chuffed with the bit that I did down here that stops all the 
cold air coming in in the winter. So I've slept through here through all winter and it's been fine. Two duvets, that's all you need. Uh, yeah, like the roof, padded. Like there's still like bits to finish. You always need to finish stuff. There's always something to do. But yeah, so like then got the food stuff. There's not much in here at the moment, but generally you just food shop every day. Do you know what I mean? But keep stuff in there that you need. Just keeps it tidy. Uh, yeah, like under the bed, it's just loads of stuff. And then uh, I, I, I potentially I'm going to turn that into uh, with a sit down and a tables and that. But I haven't needed that to do that. And maybe I will or maybe I won't do that. But it's just a bed basically with stuff underneath it at the moment. But it works fine. So book for my clothes. So yeah, like and a little exit through into the cockpit, which is priceless for waking up needing to get out somewhere quickly if someone doesn't want you to be somewhere because you parked up or stuff like that so yeah like i think it's uh it's been stressful getting it to this stage <laughs> whilst living in it and doing it up you know that's been hard but yeah it's cool i'm happier and now it's coming into summer vibes it's like it's going to be sorted for the summer, but still need the solar power to be better. That's the main thing I need to sort out next. But yeah, thought I'd uh, show you the uh, van. Oh yeah, I've got like the obviously the window. So that's really handy as well. Window that slides on that. So, oh, that's cool. so uh, yeah, that's that. That is my van so far. And uh, I'll leave you with the sun in Bastonbury Tour.